Hey guys, welcome back to Jack Hill's Castle. Today we're here with a John Wick popcorn bucket and some John Wick coins. I didn't plan on doing this video. Um, we went, we were just going to pick up the bucket and the coins and, you know, I had heard the bucket was all right. So I didn't think we'd probably be making a video out of it. But we got hold of the coins, which I'll give you a really good look at here in a minute. And they are so cool, I figured we probably should do a mm. video. First of all, John Wick 4, what did you think? It was really good. Compared to the other ones? Might be my favorite. Might be your favorite? Yeah. It, it was great. Um, if you've liked the other ones, you can't go wrong with this one. All it is is more. More <laughs> of everything. Three hours of it. Yeah, almost three hours of it. Yeah, it was great. So, should we start with the bucket here? Yes. All right. It's got four different sides on it. And when they give it to you, um, they do give you the bucket empty, and then you poured your popcorn in it. But I'm a firm believer in enjoying our popcorn buckets, so forgive the popcorn residue in the bottom here. Um, we did use it. It's got the uh, coins on the inside here. Wait, can I see? Mm -hmm. See them on there? Oh, yeah. And here is the pack of coins we got. First of all, when we showed up, I thought it was going to be two of them because it showed, you know, on the little picture, it just showed two pictures of a gray one and a gold one. I thought it was going to be front and back, yeah. but it wasn't. So I was pleasantly surprised to see there were four of them. And this thing is heavy. These right. are like, they're heavy, heavy coins. Should we open them up take a yes. look? See what we got in here? All right, let's see. I assume they've got like some rubber cement or something on the back of them, maybe. No, we... No. Yeah, let me see. They're in, I guess, plastic. Oh, they're, yeah, they are in plastic. Okay, so because they're in plastic, I have no choice but to leave it up to the master here of whether or not we're going to remove these from their plastic coffin or whether we're going to keep them in here. Um, I think we might should keep them in here. You sure? Okay, let's open them. <laughs> Got him to do it. All right. So, I think we're going to have to just tear this thing open. I don't think there's any way around it. All right. <laughs> it pains him. <laughs> Might as well enjoy them, though, you know? Yeah. Okay. And you can hear how heavy these things are. Because the big question is, what's on the back of them? So let's see. They all, uh, oh, not all of them. Okay, that's kind of cool. Except for this one. This is the only different one. Well, it's going to be hard to show them from back there. Yeah. Should we give them a close-up? Yes. Okay, let's start with this first gold one we got here. Mm -hmm. Now, I think that's These the really coin nice. they used uh, to get into the uh, kind of like hotel, I guess. Yeah, there's a lot, there's quite a few different coins and stuff in the movie, and I'm not going to lie, I am not exactly sure which one was used for what. Yeah. Um, you know, he always hands them a gold coin. I'm not sure if it's this one or the other one. Now, here's one. Now, this one I know is not in the movie. Yeah. It's just got Keanu's face on there. Where do you think you could get into with Keanu's face? Nowhere. What do you mean nowhere? Everyone loves Keanu. Well, I mean, in the movie, they try and, like... I guess not everyone in the movie loves Keanu. Yeah, they try and kill him. Okay. And then this one is the high table symbol. I'm pretty sure of that, right? I think it is. I think this is the symbol of the high table. This one has the name again on the back. Now, to me, this is the coolest one. And this leads me to believe that I think Jackson is right. That this is probably the one that they always hand out in the movie at the uh, hotels and everything. Because this one doesn't have the name on the back. This one is actually like a replica of the movie prop, which is really yeah. cool. Because I wasn't sure if the others were, it, it, nothing said what they would look like on the back. Yeah. So to me, this is definitely the coolest one of the bunch, yeah. um, since it is a little bit of a prop replica. So what's your verdict here? I really like this one. I like the coins a lot. The coins are awesome. And um, the bucket, like... Yeah, the bucket's pretty nice, but to me, the coins are yeah. what you're paying for. I think it was $25, wasn't it? $24.99 yeah. or something like that. Um, 
I have a pretty good feeling once people see how nice these are, they're going to go quick. So if you do want one, I would head up to AMC as soon as possible because that movie is going to be huge this weekend, I think. So if we go and we find another cool popcorn bucket or anything at AMC, we'll be back. Please like and subscribe. Bye. Bye.